This video is about how to solve simultaneous equations, and the way I'm going to do it is by equating coefficients. Simultaneous equations are sets of algebraic equations, and we are asked to find the unknowns. So the question is as follows. 3a plus 2b equals 4, and 2a plus b equals 3. So the first thing we want to do with this question is label the equations so that they're easier to work with. So at the top here we've got 3a plus 2b equals 4 and I'm going to label this equation number 1. Just underneath it we have 2a plus b equals 3 and I'm going to label this equation number 2. So for us to solve this question we have to make one set of the coefficients to be the same. So the number in front of the a's has to be the same or the number in front of the b's has to be the same. How do we do this? Well, we can multiply one or both of the equations so that we get one set of the coefficients to be the same. In our question, I want to make the b's the same. So in equation number one, we've got 2b. And in equation number two, I have 1b. So what do I multiply 1b by to get 2b? The answer, of course, is 2. So I'm going to rewrite equation number 1 exactly the same because we're not multiplying this equation by anything. So we've got 3a plus 2b equals 4. I'm going to rewrite equation number 2, but everything in this equation is going to be multiplied by 2. So we've got 2a times 2 gives us 4a. We've got b times 2, and this gives us 2b. And we've got 3 times 2, which gives us 6. Again, I'm going to label the equations. So I've got equation number 1 here, and I've got in equation number 2 here, which has been multiplied by 2. So the next thing we want to do is subtract equation number 2 from equation number 1. So we've got 3a minus 4a, which gives us minus a. We've got plus 2b minus 2b which cancels out. We've got 4 minus 6, which gives us minus 2. We're going to divide both sides by minus 1, which leaves us with a as 2. We have now found a value for a. We can substitute this value of a into one of the equations to find out what b is. So I'm going to use equation number 1. So we've got 3a plus 2b equals 4. a is 2, so 3 times 2 is 6, plus 2b equals 4. We're going to subtract 6 from this side, so we're going to subtract 6 from this side. And we're left with 2b equals minus 2. We're going to divide both sides by 2 to get b on its own, which gives us b as minus 1. We have now found values for both a and b, but we need to do a quick check to ensure that these values are correct. We need to substitute both values into one of the equations to make sure that they are right. So I'm going to use equation number 2. So we've got 2a plus b equals 3. We think that a is 2, so 2 times 2 equals 4. We think that b is minus 1. 4 plus minus 1 should equal to 3. And indeed, 4 plus minus 1 does equal to 3. So we can be sure that our values are correct. Thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you now understand how to solve simultaneous equations.